One time there were two kingdoms right next to each other and the two families that ruled these kingdoms didn't like each other and were always niggling and nagging at each other and every so often some generation would declare war on the others. And this went on throughout history until one particular time one king invaded the other country and war was declared and all the young men between 16 and 30 had to fight in the war. And then on the other side, every man between 16 and 30 had to fight and go into the war. And there was many, many casualties. And not, no side was really winning. So then they decided anybody under the age of 40 would have to go out, any man to the age of 40 would have to go out to war. And the other side decided any man that was under 40 would have to go to war. And no side were really winning yet, but there was a lot of casualties on both sides. And then they said any man under 50 would now have to go to war on both sides. And there was a wise little goat herd who carried his goats from one country to the other, over and back through the mountains. And now he was afraid because he was 52 years of age. And he said, this war won't be over until I'm sent to the front line. And he had to think. So he went down into one city on one side of the border and they started going on about the great war and their great king and how um, everybody should defend his honour. And the goatherd said, well, why doesn't that king fight the other king in a fight to the death and see who'd win? And then after that, let the army generals fight. And after that, let the prime ministers fight. And they all went away thinking. And he carried his goats over the mountains into the other country. And he said the same thing. He said, why don't the, ki the kings have a fight? And why don't the prime ministers have a fight? And the army generals have a fight? Rather than the ordinary men and women of the country suffering and the men going out to war, why not the two kings get into a ring and see who wins the fight? Well, word spread like wildfire fire from city to town, from town to city. All the soldiers stopped fighting and they said, yes, let the kings fight and go into a ring and only one man come out alive and he, the country is the winner then. And very quickly, the kings made a truce and there was never a war again.